All right, so we're going to get right into it. What is HACCP? What is the concept of HACCP? So once again, we talked about the system piece. Um, it's also based on common sense application of science and technology, which includes planning, controlling, and documenting safe production of food. Right, so planning, once again, we talked about that, but we plan how are we going to do this? What's the plan based on a knowledge of our system, the knowledge of the product that we run? We now we've got that. All right. Now, how do we control these hazards? Right. So part of the plan is controlling the hazards. Right. So understanding what hazards we have and then, you know, when those come about, how do we control it? And then the last piece is so very important. Doc, document, document, document. If you didn't document, it didn't happen. I love the fact how, um, you know, this relates so much to today and social media days, you know, where people, you know, believe a lot of people believe that, you know, they got to document everything on social media. So if they're going to the store, then, you know, they buy a nice pair of gym shoes, they're going to document it. They got to take the picture. You know, some people taking the pictures of things that they don't necessarily need to. Oh my gosh, I wish we had that same thought process in food facilities everywhere. We'd be awesome because when issues arise, we'll have the document and it's accurate and you know it's clear and we know it. So that's the documentation piece. We need to document it. If you didn't document it, it didn't happen. Has a concept. So moving over. So we are covering all uh, three types of potential food safety hazards, which have been around for ages um, and dip many different forms. But they all break down to these three different types. And that's the biological, chemical and physical hazards. Right. So um, understand those. Write those down. That is a point we need to all know. Um, and chances are, if you're already in the food safety industry, I mean, the food industry, uh, I keep saying food safety industry. I'm in the food safety industry. Uh, if you are in the food industry, biological, chemical, and physical hazards are so very important. So what does that mean? We break it down. So when it comes to micro, we're referring to biological. When it comes to chemicals, so chemicals can go in a, quite a different, uh, quite a few ways, right? There's, there's quite a few things that go under chemical. Allergens is one of them that goes under chemicals. It's a chemical hazard. It's not a biological hazard, and it's definitely not a physical hazard. So we'll talk about those. Um, and then the last one is physical, which I think everybody knows about, right? So that's the glass, the wood, you know, plastic, anything else that comes along with the product um, that may cause a food safety issue further down the line. So hazards may be naturally occurring in food contributed by, once again, the environment, um, mistake during processing. It could be the supplier. It could be, you know, your uh, employee that, you know, has something on their on their clothing. I don't know what it is. It could be quite a few things. Right. So um, we got to be mindful of that and learn how to control it. So HACCP, we focus on the prevention of problems that could lead to foodborne illness or injury. It's either one, right? Nine times out of 10, if it's a physical hazard, it's going to be an injury. If it's a uh, chemical or biological, we have illnesses that occur. Food, uh, HACCP can be applied throughout the food chain. Actually, it should be applied. Actually, you know, I'd say it's mandated. We have to apply that throughout the food chain because if you don't catch it at the farm chances are you're going to have a big issue at the table and the spread of that right the impact is so much greater uh further up the chain than further down commonly applied in manufacturing settings and once again i mean due to the regulations it's it's imperative that we have that in all manufacturing settings some form of hassle 